super excited to show you guys the winter box from Decorated. I swear they have everything that I love pretty much pegged at this point um, as far as colors and stuff go. I'm super excited about this box and I can't wait to use it. So as always, there's a little booklet that kind of breaks down the collection. It talks about the artist that designed pieces for the collection and then it breaks down the color scheme, which I mean, those icy blues and greens, this is right up my alley. Um, and it gives you examples on how to use the pieces. Um, it's an excellent little guidebook. And they also show you how to work in this box with previous boxes and collections too, which is super helpful. So let's start with the art. How cute is that? And that's gonna show you all of the colors from this collection um, and really the style of the collection for this season. So pinks and blues and greens. And then on the back, it says Winter Wonderland. Super cute. I like that you can use it for Christmas decorating and for winter post-Christmas stuff in general. So let's go ahead and see what we got. First one is this little wood snowflake. I love this. It's so cute. Um, it's not like any other decor that I have. Um, I kind of stayed away from a lot of natural wood decorations in the last house just because we had wood trim and wood doors. Um, but in this house we have white. So it's actually kind of nice to work some wood into my decorations. The next one is this fun little calendar. So it's got the boxes um, with the blocks with the days of the week and the days of the month and then um, the numbers and you just kind of open it up and switch it out. Uh, I love this. This room is completely empty right now but it's going to be like an office of sorts for me and a guest room. So I'm excited to have that little calendar so that I can change it out and adjust it. Um, every day while I'm in here uh, working on my computer or just hanging out hiding from my children. <laughs> okay, this is my favorite piece from this box. How cute are these little houses? Um, so it's blocks of wood with the little houses painted on them. They're super cute and adorable. I love the colors. So you had like a dark gray. This is like a gray blue. This is blue. <laughs> Um, and then there is also a tree. How cute. I don't have a mantle in this house, but I have been decorating, um, our bar in the kitchen. Um, so I think that's going to become kind of my mantle and I'm totally going to use that with the little Christmas houses that I have from last year. Um, there's also this fun sleigh, which, um, can be used as a tabletop display. Um, or it's got the hooks so that you can hang it on the wall and use it as a shelf. Um, super cute, super great for winter. I will probably hang this up and maybe put some seasonal tchotchkes or something on it. Um, maybe even here in this room. And then we also have two more pieces. So let's do this first is this pillow. The greens and blues. It's very winter, not strictly Christmas. It's got fun green um, and it's super silky uh, on the back and then it's like a woven natural fibers kind of material on the front. So I'm super excited. This is just the case and I don't have a pillow this size. However, I have a ton of tiny throw pillows um, without covers that I'm probably not going to make covers for. So I think I'm going to sacrifice them to make the stuffing for this pillow because this has to go on my couch. I love it. Um, the last piece is this. It has a hook where you can hang it on the back. Like, um, so you could hang it up somewhere. I could totally see um, attaching, you know, maybe some photos to it. Um, the greens in this really match the rest of um, the wintry decorations. I could see if you paired it with like snowflakes, it would look kind of wintry, um, but I really think that this can be used any time of year. Um, and honestly, I could also see myself using it as a tray just to kind of um, 
set and display things on or um you know obviously i wouldn't put food on this because it's probably not food safe but you know little like serving pieces or drinks um and just kind of carrying it around if we were entertaining this year but you know we've had lots of family movie nights so i could see you know a bowl of popcorn and some special drinks and just kind of carrying it in um to whatever room we're hanging out in watching movies but um like I said, this box really coordinates well with the box from the winter box from last year, from 2019. And so I kind of wanted to show that to you guys um, a little bit. So I think I'm gonna use the pillowcase as my example. So you have the pillowcase with the greens and the blues. And then look at these trees from last year. Like it matches perfectly. There's three of them there. I'll wear this like this so you guys can see. But like, there are three different little trees and like the colors just match perfectly. Um, so I definitely am gonna use all of this together. Um, and then I also have this super cute, super fuzzy, it's a waffle knit blanket and it was in the 2019 box and the green in this matches the greens in here perfectly and it also coordinates really well with um, the art and the natural wood and green just kind of is a timeless combination. So I can't wait to use this stuff for both my Christmas decorations and then transitioning out of Christmas and into just winter in general. Uh, if you're interested in Decorated, you can still sign up to get the winter box. I have a $10 off code, attempts at domestication 10, and I, if you wanna check that out, you can get the links in the caption. I can't wait to decorate.